Yo, what is going on guys? I am back with another video today. And today is another G Fuel one. Yesterday, I did the uh, Sanic Chili Dogs review. Uh, if, you got, if you haven't watched that one, I'd recommend going and checking that out because I mean, yeah, I would, I would just go recommend checking it out. So the first, okay, I don't think I was supposed to get that sticker. We got paper, don't need that. Empty box now. And the sticker in here is Hive Nectar sticker, which I'm really glad I got because I don't, I don't think I was supposed to get it. I thought it would only come with the collector's box uh, and I did not get that. But it is a pretty dope sticker. I like the black and yellow. And then like the three little bees going around. The honey dripping down. Stuff like that. And you guys probably already know. Hive nectar right here. We're going to be trying this out today. This one will definitely be better than the chili dogs flavor. I'd hope anyway. If it's not. Then uh, that's disappointing. But. I mean, let's just get get straight into it. Let's open it up. If I can, there we go. Now this is actually a pretty sick um, G Fuel tub. I like the the detail of the 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 honeycomb all around it. Um, the the honey dripping down again, like that. There's some some spots that are uh, black most are yellow but it is a pretty decent tub i i i really like how uh how it looks i think it's a nice design but i'm hoping we have a new new favorite right here Okay, so it's kind of a peach, uh, peach color on the inside. If you can see that, it's a little bit of a light peach color. If I can grab this scoop, it's right at the top. It's just buried a little bit. There we go. Got it. I need to smack all the powder that's in there out. That's not a good spot for that. Okay. So I always do this. This top part comes off not for, this part is not a whole scoop. Whole scoop goes to right here. This is just to funnel it into a water bottle if you don't use shakers. But I always use shakers, so I rip that off. <sighs> Got a little bit of powder on my desk. Um. So I mean, let's let's start it off with smelling it. Okay. Oh, I got some on my nose. It's never good. Okay. It it kind of does smell like honey. Um, I can't remember exactly what the actual flavor is. Um, there's like nectarine, I believe, which is a type of fruit or something, kind of like a peach, maybe. Oh God, I got a bunch on my nose right there. Holy crap. Well, definitely smells better than the chili dogs. I'll give it that. Okay, every time I smell it, I get more on my nose. Okay. So it, it kind of smells like, like honey a little bit. I'm using my XQC shaker that I got with his collector's box. One full scoop, as even as I can possibly get it. Dump it straight in there. Right when it hit the water, it already started to turn just a little bit yellow, obviously, because, you know, if it wasn't yellow, I'd be very surprised. 
I'm going to try to line that up later. Because, yeah. I, I really like to line up my my tubs, the design. I It always looks better. I have them like, in my, in my room, I have them next to my TV and a little bit behind. So it's uh, definitely being shown off. So I always like to line mine up just for that reason. But dude, I'm actually really excited for this. I I talked about it a few times at work. I'm sure nobody there cared. But I, I still talked about it anyway. I did try to get the collector's box for it. Um, it did release on my birthday and I was working um, and it sold out. I think it sold out before it was even available um, unless they released it early because I, I, I told my manager there was something I needed to do at the time so I could pick it up and left a little bit early, you know, and it was sold out. So I wasn't able to get the box, but which is fine because I wasn't the biggest fan of the shaker i've already got one that's uh glow in the dark and i don't really need need another one i'd probably just sell it or just keep it in the collection in the back all right but this this should all be good so let's uh it is a kind of a light lighter yellow but uh let's smell it okay i'm not sure what that smell is actually but it is pretty good. Yeah, I can't, I can't tell. Uh, I mean, so yeah, let's just try it. Okay. Now, I am not sure what that flavor is. I have no idea what it tastes like. Like there's nothing coming to my mind when I try this. It is making my, uh, my mouth a little bit dry every time I drink it. But, yeah, I can't tell you what the flavor is because um, I have no idea. But what I do know is it is good. It starts off with it, some kind of fruit. Um, it's, a, it's a really nice taste. And the end taste of it is, is a bit bitter, but it's not too bad where it's like an overwhelming bitterness. And it is actually like a, a really nice flavor damn i think i'm gonna have to put this one above sour green apple i'm not sure about the other four though or the other five i think this might i might like this a little bit more than maiden's blood so it'll be in the top five but I don't know about Bahama Mama. <coughs> Damn. Okay, there we go. Got all that powder out of my nose. Let's go. Yeah. So, I mean, it's, it starts off, like, pretty sweet. Um, still have no idea what kind of fruit that is. But starts off sweet, ends a little bit bitter, um, which I personally really like uh, I like a little bit of bitterness a little bit of the sweetness it's um overall pretty nice and yeah I mean I'm not sure what else to say it's a really good flavor I'd probably give it like an eight an eight point four I'll go with an eight point four yeah so pretty high on the list i want to know if you guys have tried this flavor um and what your opinions are on it so if you um if you reviewed this flavor and put it up on youtube tweet me my twitter will be in the description 
um, if I remember to put it in there, that is. Hopefully I do. Um, it'll be down there. You can tweet me your reviews, comment your opinions, tweet your opinions, at me, uh, DM me on Twitter if you want. And uh, I'll respond. I just, I wanna know what other people think of this, um, this flavor. So let me know guys. And like I said, let me know either in the comments or or on Twitter, either way. Uh, make sure you guys leave a like if you enjoyed. Comment, like I said, your opinions. Uh, also comment what flavors you'd like to see mixes with this because I'm actually really inter interested in trying some of those, like some kind of weird mixes with that. I I'm not sure what would go with well with it, but let me know if you guys know. And subscribe so you don't miss any more G or any G Fuel videos, uh, potentially sneak videos. Right now, we're doing glitch reviews as well. I just wanted to get this one out as well as Chili Dogs out uh, before I kept going with this. And I'm not sure what, what flavor to try next. So let me know in the comments if you'd like to see Tropic Thunder loopy fruits or sucker punch as the next one uh, it's it's gonna be one of those three let me know down in the comments like i said and yeah i'll have those up as soon as i possibly can and i'll catch you guys in the next one peace out